Hello students, in the previous class we were dealing with addition and subtraction of like terms. So, today we will do some problems based on this, okay, okay. that is exercise 12.2 from your reader. Question is like this, simplify combining like terms, that means you have to combine the like terms and you have to simplify this algebraic expression. So, first question is here. 21b minus 32 plus 7b minus 20b. So, first step what you do is you will combine all the like terms. So, here you can see 21b, 7b and minus 20b. These three terms are having b, variable part is containing b. That means those three terms are like terms. So, we will combine those three. So, I am going to combine it that is 21 that means I am going to rewrite it okay 21b plus 7b minus 20b okay. Now, what is left negative 32 is left write it that is negative 32 that is it you just re rewrite it okay. So, 21b plus 7b minus 20b now what you have to do is like terms you are going to simplify. That means you will write the number parts 21 plus 7 minus 20. Write it in one bracket and write the variable part outside. That means you are going to simplify the numbers. So, 21 plus the other part you write it as such that is 32 is 32 only minus 32. 21 plus 7 28, 28 minus 20 8. So, the answer will be 8b minus 30 this is how you have to write and you have to write equal to before each step ok. So, here we have the answer 8b minus 32 understood ok. Coming to the next one this is the same thing only you try by yourself the next one is containing bracket we will do that one. So, p minus p minus q. So, you can see here minus and one bracket is there. what do you mean by that bracket this is what you are going to do. So, I will simplify that bracket part first. So, here you have to use distributive property that means nothing is a you just remember the multiplication of integers you know negative into negative what is negative number multiplied with a negative number you will get a positive number negative number multiplied with a positive number you will get a negative number that only you have to remember ok. So, here this is p that means no sign is it is positive that I have told you right. So, this negative I am going to distribute inside. So, negative and positive will become negative. So, it is negative p. Same way negative and one negative. So, negative into negative it is plus. So, it is plus q. So, I have removed the bracket and my expression has become like this. That is this part has become like not the whole expression. This part has become like this. Understood how is it? Ok. Same thing only what is the next one here minus q minus p that also I am do it here minus q minus p. Here also you are going to open the bracket how will you open it you will distribute this negative. So, q means it is positive only ok. So, negative into positive negative and negative into negative it is positive that is it. So, this has become like this. So, now we will rewrite the question ok. Understood how is it? Ok. So, shall we write it once? So, p first p is p only no change. Now, we are going to open the bracket it will be minus p plus q. Understood? Ok. Same way minus q nothing is there write like that. Now, again you are going to open the bracket. So, minus q plus p. Clear? Now, we will collect all the like terms. So, p minus p. So, p minus p is here. Then what else? Any other p term? Yeah, here also one p is. So, write it. That is it. Now, coming to q plus q minus q minus q. That is it. Just count the terms and see. Here how many terms are there? 6. Here also 6 only. So, this correct all. So, here. Now, we are going to simplify it. I told you it just p means there is 1 p. Okay. So, it is 1 p minus 1 p plus 1 p same way here also plus 1 q minus 1 q 
minus 1 q ok. Now you will So, what is the first one? 1 p minus 1 p plus 1. So, what you will do is you will collect all the numbers and write it in one bracket. So, it will be 1 minus 1 then what is that 1 minus 1 plus 1 right. Okay. So, plus 1. So, what will be the variable part? p. Okay. Now, what is it? 1 minus 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 minus 1 ok any confusion plus 1 always plus only ok plus 1 plus 1 sorry plus 1 minus 1 minus 1 so we will connect write that and write q now tell me what is 1 minus 1 0 0 plus 1 1 so it is 1 p 1 minus 1 0 0 minus 1 minus 1 it is so it is minus 1 q so the answer is this here. So, this is how you have to do it. Go through the question once, understand and then do it, you will get it. Okay. Coming to the next one, same thing only, opening the bracket only, you will have some doubt and then that integer addition subtraction, that you should know integer addition and subtraction laws that you have studied in lower classes. Okay. So, you are going to open, uh, you are going to rewrite the question once. 3a minus 2b minus a b till there no problem now comes the bracket so before bracket what do you have negative so we're going to open the bracket so it will be negative a plus b you know why is it plus b here negative here negative 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 plus so plus b negative a b okay so that's it we open the bracket now the other terms that is plus 3 a b plus b minus a clear put one equal to before this okay now collect all the like terms so first term is 3a so 3a is here any other uh, here you can see minus a then where is it okay. 3a minus a then here also one minus a is here okay then what next next is minus 2b. So, I will write minus 2b. Any other b? Uh, here you have can see plus b. Then where is here also plus b. Okay. Then what next? Yes, minus ab term is here. Minus ab. Then again here minus ab. Here plus 3ab. Check whether all terms have written or not. Okay. Here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 terms are here. So, here also 9 terms should come. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So, 9 terms are there. So, it is correct. So, rearrangement is correct. Now, you are going to find the answer. So, what is first one? 3a minus a minus a. How will you write it? I told you write the number part separately. Okay. So, it will be 3 minus 1. Right. Minus 1 only. No. No number means it is minus 1. Minus 1 only. Here also it is minus 1. So, minus 1. Variable is a. Okay. What is next one? Minus 2b plus b plus b. How will you write it? Minus 2b. So, I told you whenever minus, I told you no plus minus, just remember in your mind. Okay. So, you can write it as minus 2 plus 1. 1 only, no. Here also plus only, no. So, it is plus 1 outside you can write b. So, now what is next one? Here also minus a b. So, you have to write it as plus minus 1 then again minus 1 minus 1 only no ok plus 3 outside you can write a b. Any doubt? Please go through that ok. Now simplify 3 minus 1, 2, 2 minus 1, 1. So it is 1a minus 2 plus 1, minus 1, minus 1 plus 1, 0. So it is 0b minus 1 minus 1, minus 2, minus 2 plus 3, plus 1. A. So this is the final answer. Clear? Any doubt?